I get such a kick out of this. Listen to the Christian Brian Fisher lust for war. You know, one of the things that in just war theory, and this is one of the problems with President Obama being so disparaging of Christianity and Christian theology, one of the one of the the elements of Christian theology, political theology down through the ages has been the concept of a just war. And and one the, the two of the principles of a just war is that your cause must be just. You must be fighting on the side of what is right. Well, President Obama didn't think he was. Remember, his sympathies are with the Islamic faith. I wouldn't be surprised at all if his antipathy in sending our troops into Afghanistan was that they were going to be killing Muslims. And that offended some basic sensibility that he had because his sympathies are far more with Islamic faith than with Christianity. Good point. Obama's sympathies are with the Muslims, which is why we are currently droning Muslims in Pakistan, Yemen, and Somalia, which is why we tried to extend the war in Iraq but couldn't get an agreement, which is why Obama is trying to extend the war in Afghanistan 11 more years. But yeah, Obama's a pussy that doesn't like war and sympathizes with Muslims. I wish he didn't like war and did sympathize with Muslims more and I wish he sympathized with all humans more, but he doesn't. And I always find it funny when the, the same guy who ripped Obama for going to Reverend Wright's church all of a sudden says, well, he's sympathetic to Muslims. Well, which is it, buddy? You can't have it both ways. You can't attack him for sitting in a church and then also say, well, he's kind of a Muslim too. Can't have it both ways, but they try to do it anyway. And they also try to add on top of that, he's an atheist communist also. Well, for Christ's sake, what is he, everything? Every descriptor fits him? Do you not realize that it's logically impossible for him to be all those things at once? And finally, did you realize what was the implication of what Brian was saying there? And this is the point I alluded to before the clip. Like, he's kind of saying, like, well, this guy should be more in favor of the war in Afghanistan and Iraq and all this stuff. Brian, aren't you a fundamentalist Christian? Okay, did you read anything that your Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, said? Turn the other cheek? You know what that means? Go ahead. Hit me on one, one cheek. I'll present the other one. Hit that one too, big guy. Go ahead. Go for it. He's a pacifist. Way more liberal than me. I'm a non-interventionist, which means I don't want to start shit with anybody. The only time I want to use our military is if we are about to get attacked. If it's in imminent danger of attack, I want to use it for self-defense. That's it. Jesus isn't even for that. He says, look, if you're going to attack us, well, I'm a pacifist. No matter what, I don't fight back. That's how I do.